a lot of firms have been um, unfortunately put in that position where they did have to lay off people and then other firms like the firm i work for they decided instead of having to let people go especially during this hard time it was better for everyone to temporarily take a pay cut hey guys welcome back to my channel for those of you guys who don't know me my name is nicole and i'm so happy you clicked on this video oh guys let's talk so much has been going on and I just thought I'd come on here to just talk to you guys, catch you guys up on what has been going on, um, especially within the accounting industry. So before I get into the video, like always, if you haven't already, please make sure you go ahead and subscribe to my channel and help this family grow. Don't forget to turn on your notification bell so you are notified every time I upload a video. My uploading schedule is Sunday, Tuesday, and Thursday, but I do occasionally throw in a video on a random day of the week so make sure your notification bell is turned on and lastly please make sure you go ahead and give this video a thumbs up if you like the content so that i can continue to make these kinds of videos for you guys share with your friends and without further ado let's get in the video all right guys so first of all i just want to say thank you thank you thank you for all of my new subscribers thank you guys for all of your love and support on this channel thank you guys for participating in the live that i did <laughs> thank you for participating in that live and i just wanted to talk to you guys and interact and give you guys an update as to what was going on and today i decided to make a sit down video in case you missed that live First, let me start off by just giving guys an update as to what has been going on um, within the accounting world, within the accounting community. So you guys do know what's going on in the world with, we're not going to say the name, but um, it has taken a toll on the economy. And that means it has taken a toll on um, institutions, on jobs, on companies, and it has trickled down to us in the accounting world guys like what <laughs> but in everything don't let anything that I'm about to say or um, whatever update is going on don't let that keep you from pursuing your accounting degree trust me accounting is valuable it is a degree that you are going to need it is going to be beneficial to you even when all of this is over so um a few updates that have been going on a lot of firms have been um unfortunately put in that position where they did have to lay off people um I saw a few firms here and there. I did mention them in my live. So a, a lot of firms, um, especially like big four firms, did have to let people go, which is very unfortunate. Um, but it's understandable because at this time, everyone is taking a loss. Um, so if your client is taking a loss, it's kind of hard for them to pay you so a lot of firms have um had to reduce their staff um and then other firms like the firm i work for they decided instead of having to let people go especially during this hard time it was better for everyone to temporarily take a pay cut so they agreed upon a certain percentage and communicated that with everyone um a few weeks ago so that way we are all going through it together um we are all unfortunately we have to take a temporary pay cut but it is better to do that to offset the finances instead of having to let people go because whenever the economy does pick back up we're going to have to be doing mass hiring again looking for people um when it's better to do it this way just to weigh it out so that way um, those who are already in the company can keep building that rapport that relationship with the company and with the clients as well um, and then whenever things do pick back up audits will continue and you already have people who have the skills and the knowledge instead of having to spend money on training um, yeah a lot of 
I know other firms have been going that route and another thing is that a lot of audits are on hold right now so you guys know that we're in busy season uh, we're kind of we're supposed to be at the tail end of busy season however there's clients who are meant to file obviously in April that due to the issues going on are not able to file and some clients busy season begin in the summer and um, obviously the impact of this has in turn affected if they if audits can go on or not just because people are not working therefore people are not in the offices to provide support not everybody feels comfortable sending support and certain documentations electronically some people prefer having audit presence at the at on their site um so all of that is has been going on and that has in turn caused um, some firms or some engagement teams to be really slow with their work they're still working um, people are still getting paid their salaries however there's certain audits that have just been halted so certain audits that have been paused for right now until further notice and with that it brings me to my next point in terms of clients so clients and how they are dealing with this so you guys know as auditors or in the public accounting practice we are client serving we serve clients we bill our clients for our time and our work and it's unfortunate if the client isn't making revenue they're taking losses it's very hard for us to bill them how we normally build them so it's kind of a loss on both sides so it's we as as an audit firm if we want to maintain that relationship with our clients we will need to reevaluate our fees going forward until everything picks back up which does mean that us as a firm or audit firms are taking a loss in revenue as well but then looking on the client standpoint clients have to also think what's best for them and their company and their employees so they also are looking to cut back on expenses which means paying uh, like fees like audit fees legal fees we need they need to also cut down on those expenses to help offset their losses so that's how we are all intermingled into it. Um, and yeah, it's just been a very interesting situation. I, my heart does go out to anybody who is watching this video and has unfortunately taken a loss in terms of employment. Um, I do feel for you. It is hard because I was scared actually. Uh, my husband and I, we were scared that a few weeks ago that that could have potentially been our situation. I, My heart does go out to you, but please just keep praying and keep your hopes up that things will go back to normal and there will be another solution. Um, you will be able to find another job. Just really be hopeful in this time. Just use this time to rest, to reset, refresh your mind. Um, obviously, it's hard not to think about the financial impact, um, but just don't let let that overtake this opportunity to just um, refresh your mind, reset, reconnect, and just think of new opportunities for yourself in terms of generating income. So those are the main things that I know that have been going on. So I hope this video did help somebody. Uh, comment your thoughts down below if you think anything I missed if you guys like this video if you guys didn't like this video and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I will see you in my next video